is Nicholas with Deep South Outdoors, and today we are back at Four Seasons Equipment here in Tupelo, Mississippi, and we are going to be taking a look at the 2025 Yamaha Wolverine RMAX 1000. This is the XTR model, extreme terrain. And for this particular unit, what you're looking at is what will come standard. On this video, do a general walk around real quick before we start diving into it. So this unit does come standard with the Maxxis Carnivores. These are size 30s. Beautiful, good looking tire. And you got the Fox Performance Shocks with 14.2 inches of travel. You got your guard right there. Very well built, very well designed machine. Come standard with a forty five. 100 pound winch. Thirteen point eight inches of ground clearance. Take a look under the hood. Got your rubber garments and your locking pins that you gotta pull out. We went ahead and did that ahead of time. Take a look up under the hood. Good space to get your radiator to, but it's still tucked away to keep it protected, so that's very nice. Set that right there real quick. Take a look. And they went ahead and got your loose connection points for you to plug up accessories. Batteries mounted up top. Air intake box. That's your GPS tracker. access to get to that. I like how all the electrical stuff is up out of the way because typically with these machines from what I've seen a lot of people like to try and send these jokers deep so Yamaha took that into consideration. Went ahead and got that hood back on. I love the graphics too. Got your rock sliders. Let's check out the dog bed. You got two of them, so extra support. You gonna have you ain't gonna have any issues dumping anything. Turn the light on so we can see up in here a little better. They definitely have the engine tucked away and protected too.
Went ahead and cut my light on so we be a little easier to see everything. I love how the bed's designed too. It's very sleek, very stylish, but can still get the job done too. Let's get up in here and take a look. See how everything looks up in here. Close this bed. Got your holding down points. It's always nice to have those. You got something like a cooler. Let's go ahead and check out the inside. Got your door handle on the inside. And it does come with a sound system. And your mirror. And something else I noticed too is that these seats are super, super plush and comfortable. And that's a new feature they added to the 2025 model. You now have turf mode for those of you that just want to cruise around your yard and only have the one wheel turn so it doesn't rut up everything or tear up everything. They got that feature now. A lot of people like that feature. Let's take a seat on up in here. Remove that paper. Plenty of room too. Plenty of room. Beautiful display and also full color touch screen display. And it'll tell you your drive system. So right now we have it in turf mode. Say I want to go to two wheel drive. Boom, locked in. Let's check out four wheel. Oh, there we go. Then we'll do diff lock. Boom, there we go. I'm gonna go ahead and move this back to turf mode. I love that feature. I ain't got a device paired to it right now. But you can go through your settings. I love that. Got your winch control. You got sport, trail, and crawl. Electronic power steering, that's gonna be for higher sensitivity, standard or lower sensitivity. You can adjust that as you ride, or the type of trail rider that you are. Good storage too. Good grab handle too. Now I know I've already said it, but this seat is super comfortable. 
It really is. And something else I've noticed about this unit is that even though it's more of a sport, you're not sitting completely down in the cockpit. You're still mounted up high. So that way it's still easy to see around you. And I really like that. I really do. You got your additional switch ports. Little cubby hole right here. Good little compartment too. Right there in between you. So we're going to cover the size of the dimensions. Take a closer look at that while we let y'all observe the beauty of the machine. Alright, so the stance width is 64 inches. The length of it total is 119 inches. The width of it is 66 inches. And the height total is 77.8 inches. The wheelbase in total is 86.7 inches. Fuel capacity is 9.2 gallons. And the total wet weight of this machine is 1,876 pounds. I think the biggest thing that gets me is how comfortable it is to sit in it. So if you want this unit, or if you want the other style units, he's got discounts on them as well. Come check him out. You don't want the two-seater, that's fine. He's still got the four-seater. Beautifully colored and designed machine check that out 3,000 off he's got all these good looking machines in his store lawnmowers four wheelers he's got it so come check them out I like what you see